So you might want to spice up your Twitch channel a little bit, maybe by a channel trailer, or maybe you have a cool speed run to show off, or maybe you won an event of some sort. Well today I'm going to teach you guys how to upload videos on Twitch. People don't use this feature often, but when people do, it's kind of tricky to navigate. So firstly, you're going to go to your creator dashboard and on the left hand side, you're going to click content right above me. And then also right above me, you're going to hit video producer. That's going to take you where your highlights are stored, where your uploads are stored and your past broadcasts. But starting April 19, 2025, you're going to only have 100 hours of storage in your channel. But this only includes highlights and uploads. Which if you want to know more about that, I made a video a couple weeks ago and I will leave it right in the corner or in the description below. So if I filter these by uploads, I, literally the only one is my channel trailer. If you have a cool speed run, or again if you want an event, or you just have a really cool moment that you want on your Twitch forever, I definitely recommend that. So how to upload your channel trailer or something that you want to you know, upload. You're going to click this upload button right here. It's really small. It's going to go into your programs. Uh, I'm just going to upload this again for my sake. It's going to take a little bit, but it will upload. What follows is a brief construction montage. We hope you enjoyed this brief construction montage. Once it's done, it's going to process just like a YouTube video if you think about it. But you can still go in and change the title, the description, you can change the language, you can type a category, say if it's like a Minecraft video or just chatting, but you can also put up a thumbnail. Now if you want to go into like Canva or something, put up a thumbnail, you can, and then it'll give you the URL and then you can press publish. I'm going to press cancel. Now to delete a video or VOD, you can go over here and you can either press publish or delete. I'm just going to delete this one and it will show you how much storage you will have remaining right after it so i deleted it it's gone if for whatever reason you want to publish to like youtube or tiktok you press the channel here and you can re-download it just in case you don't have it in your files again and you want to re-download it uh you can add to so you can like have like little collections um when you like upload a VOD or highlight something you can have little collections uh, you could share, so this is like the video link instead of scrolling down here. Or you can unpublish and just have it private for yourself. And you can also do permissions, so you could do it to everyone or subscribers only. Or you could go back to the VOD page if it's like a, if it's like a full on VOD, but this is not a VOD, this is a, uh, like video. So, I will show you how to highlight something, because I do have to highlight something anyway. So, you're gonna scroll up to a video that you want to, or broadcast that you want to highlight. I'm going to, that's the wrong one. I'm going to press this one right here. Ajax sold to be, da, 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 da. we're going to collect a starting point. Now if I stop this here, you can also see where clips were shown. Uh, I believe if you put a stream marker down, you can see where stream markers are. But you can make as many highlights as you want. This one, I just want like a full segment of a, an event. So I'm just gonna click publish, uh, publish. And again, you can put a thumbnail on this one too if you want. Uh, there's video IRL and just, again, the same thing. But save changes. And it's going to take a little bit the process, but it will be there. Those are highlights and uploads. If you guys have any questions, leave them down below. And if you want something else to see, then you can click right over there. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!